What's up guys, Matt in a hat, Matt Johnson Real Estate, powered by Keller Williams Diamond Partners. You are tuned in to the hot list. And as you guys jump in here, make sure that you hit that thumbs up button, you share this out, invite somebody in here that is going to benefit from this and that you would like to, to share this with as well. And as you guys know, while I'm waiting for Facebook to bring me some peoples and build me an audience, I like to come in here and share this out as well. All right, so now we got that shared. You guys know I come to you Monday through Friday around 12 o'clock Central Standard Time. And what do we talk about? We talk about a property that is new to the market, that has been on the market, has had a price reduction, something unique about the property. And I answer your questions. You, the viewer, I answer your questions. And we spend a little time together and get to know each other. And my goal here is to help people, educate people, uh, inform you, and give you some, some realness and uh, some overall, overall information. So today, I think what we're going to start doing each week, I'm going to do, do this a little differently. So you'll notice that the question of the day is going, today is going to be a, a continuous question that we're, and I feel like I'm going to continue to update you guys throughout this process and throughout this year. So Let's get started, shall we? Property we are talking about today is a favorite of mine. Why? Because it's my listing. The address is 518 Northeast Street in Lebo. Three bed, three bath, one car attached garage. Has a number of outbuildings. Got a little shop, Kwanzaa Hut kind of deal. Does have a pond on it. Got a creek running through it. Got some nice tree, some nice tree coverings, and we're talking 19 acres. So you got cows, horses, sheep, goats, chickens. You want to check this place out because 19 acres. You can put you can put some animals on 19 acres, y'all. Uh, there's also a spot for for a garden. Uh, what I love about the house, a very open concept. So between your kitchen, your living room, your dining room, very open, uh, very, very welcoming, uh, and not, you know, blocked off and chopped off by, by walls. So that part is awesome. It's got three bedrooms, two bathrooms on the main floor. The basement level does have full basement, does have the potential for a fourth bedroom. There's a non-conforming bedroom down, down there right now, as well as another bathroom. Square footage on this house is 700, 700, 1,748 square feet. And it's got a walkout, walkout basement on it as well. Um, what I also love about this house, got a fireplace, uh, new, new flooring. Cabinets are absolutely beautiful. No shortage of cabinet space or countertop space and right off of the dining room you have a screened in porch so absolutely amazing currently listed at 205,000 definitely want to check this out so if you're catching this live you're going to want to go down in the in the description click on that link it's going to take you right to my website so you can see the pictures of the house beautiful house and Watching this on the replay, comments gonna be up top. As you guys know, whether you're watching this on Facebook or YouTube, I just ask that you share this out, hit that thumbs up button on YouTube. Make sure you subscribe so I can continue to build my channel, continue to bring you guys information and videos. Now, question of the day. I mentioned we we're gonna do this a little bit different. So, question of the day is gonna be a reoccurring theme because I get this question so often, uh, it's hard to answer uh, without, you know, just being generic or extremely specific. So 
I get this question at least once a week. What I'm going to do right now is each week, I'm just going to do a market update, uh, probably Tuesdays, Tuesdays or Wednesdays. I'm not sure on the day yet. Uh, so just bear with me. We'll figure it out. So when I talk about market, I'm going to be talking about here in Lyon County in my area. Now it, it's going to be different where, where you are. Why? Because every market is different in every city. So the market I'm going to be talking about is mostly in, in the Lyon County area. I do have some numbers from the surrounding counties where I do business as well. Uh, for right now, let's focus on Lyon County. So Lyon County in the last seven days, we have had 12 new listings come on the market. Exciting, right? That's right. In the last 30 days, we've had a total of 19 come on the market. So jump over on the other side. In the last seven days, we have had seven houses that have gone under contract or closed. So market's, market's still good. Here's, here's where you want to pay attention. The last 30 days, we have had... 22 houses go under contract or close. So we've had 22 and like I said, came on the market 19. So you see, we're still at a point where we're selling more than is coming on the market. What does that mean for you? That means at some point we may run out of inventory. Inventory may run low. So if you've thought about selling your house, considered selling your house, the market is still very strong right now. And now could be, the, could be the good time for you to sell. Could be the best time for you to sell. Maybe not ideal time for you to sell. However, I would say, you know, market, market is good. Interest rates are low. That's, those are things to keep in mind because as long as that market is strong and there's a demand, people are going to buy. As long as interest rates are low, people are going to buy and sellers are going to sell because when they go to buy again, interest rates are still low. Why not, right? So to give you guys an idea of the five county area. So in this area, this is going to be Lyon County. This is going to be Osage County, Coffee County, Greenwood County, Morris County, Chase County. Those, those six counties in the last seven days, we've had 19 come on market and we've had seven that have gone under contract or closed. And in the last 30 days, 34 have come on market and 36 have gone under contract or sold. So what does that tell you? Even in the surrounding communities, we still have more going off market and getting sold and going under contract than we have coming on. So what's the market like? The market is strong like bull. Hopefully some of you guys get that, get that movie reference, but the market is still good. The market is still strong. There is still a demand. There are still people wanting to move and buy and sell whether they're, they need to upgrade if their family upsizing or downsize. What, what I'm predicting right now with COVID, the way it's kept everybody in the house come December, January, there's going to be another baby boom and people are going to be buying and selling again. So Keep that in mind. If you guys have any questions, as always, please feel free to reach out to me either through Facebook, through Messenger, or just call me, text me. My phone number is in the description. That's what I got for you guys today. I want to take a minute and just wish my, my youngest son a happy birthday. Uh, Chase turns 11. He is the, the baby of the family, and he's 11. So that means just a few more years, there's going to be some light at the end of the tunnel and Lisa and I are going to be kid free. And that is going to be awesome. But until then, uh, you know, I, I have a lot of fun with Chase. Uh, he is very much like his brother, Matthew, uh, one of my partners in crime. We get into a lot of trouble together. Um, we also cannot be trusted together is what my my wife likes to tell everybody that she cannot leave me and Chase or me and Matthew or the three of us 
alone and unsupervised because in some way, shape or form, we're going to end up buying something or getting ourselves in trouble, which is a pretty accurate and true statement. Uh, so Chase, happy birthday, made it to 11. I know there's going to be more. Uh, I can't wait till you're old enough that you can get your shit and get out. So happy birthday. Thank you guys for watching today's hot list with Matt in a hat. Matt Johnson Real Estate, powered by Keller Williams Diamond Partners. I do this because your experience matters and should be trusted with a veteran. If you all have any questions, please feel free to reach out to me. That's what I'm here for. I'm here to help you answer any of your questions. You guys have an awesome Tuesday, and I'll see you tomorrow.